exclusive live radar tracking storms so you'll know first. This is WVTM 13 weather. Another very active day in central Alabama. Severe storms move through uh, Birmingham Metro, really all areas today. Finally starting to see things quiet down over Birmingham. Uh, looks like the uh, Barons game now getting going with cloudy skies overhead. There could be a few lingering showers for a time. You can see that here on the WVTM 13 live Doppler, but that severe weather threat now confined to southern and really eastern portions of central Alabama and really for the eastern parts that severe weather threat has ended as those storms have moved out through Portions of Chilton and Coosa counties, though, a strong storm producing a lot of lightning, heavy rainfall, and right along the leading edge here, especially, we're talking about that damaging wind threat up to around 60 miles an hour. It's enough to bring down trees, and that's something that's been occurring area wide for today. Countless reports of tree damage, power lines down as well. So the severe storms in East Alabama have finally crossed over out of the state into Georgia. So that severe weather threat winding down there. Big picture here, you can see the storms they formed off to the west raced across the state today, bringing those damaging wind gusts, a lot of heavy rain, a lot of lightning with the storms as well. And guess what? We'll do it all over again. It looks like as we head into tomorrow with energy still in place, higher up in the atmosphere here at the ground level. We're talking about temperatures that will make it back up into the middle 90s tomorrow afternoon. Lots of heat, lots of humidity, heat advisory again in effect for tomorrow. And as those storms form and move off to the east, they'll be in a very unstable uh, atmosphere. Enhanced risk for eastern portions of the state much of the area though under that slight level two on our scale of one to five for severe weather uh, risk. Primary threats tomorrow damaging wind gusts and large hail. In addition, the storms will produce heavy rainfall and frequent lightning. Now it's going to be scattered in nature tomorrow, so scattered coverage of storms. Not everyone will see the storms, but where they form, where they travel, they obviously could very well be severe. So things winding down over the next few hours, a few lingering areas of light rain for a time this evening. We're quiet overnight tonight. Tomorrow around lunchtime, we're starting to see storms form across North Alabama. They'll have the tendency to move down to the south and east as we go through the afternoon. Pretty good coverage there at 2 p.m. Moving into East Alabama mid to late afternoon hours. Again, any of the storms that form tomorrow could easily turn severe, just like today. Damaging wind gusts and that potential for large Hail. So impact weather tomorrow with the strong storms in the forecast. More scattered storms out there Tuesday into Wednesday. We'll start to transition late week into a more typical summer pattern. Daily afternoon storms each day. Lots of heat, lots of humidity, high temperatures running in the 90s. Carrie. Thanks.